Hi folks, uh, this is Robert again here, and we're going to look at more of the training, and in this exercise, we're going to create a schedule template uh, that you can reuse in other projects. So uh, you see I have this schedule open here in this file <coughs> that I collected out on my training guides, uh, at least Moss, uh, 2018 River Certification um, Study Guide. So what we first thing we want to do here, we want to go into our project browser and make sure we're in the uh, room pin the schedule, which we are. And so from this point, what we want to do, we want to create a template from this schedule. So in the properties dialog box right here on the view template, we'll select this none. And as we select it, we'll get this dialog box that will open up for us. And as this dialog box opens up, we will enable show views right here. And then our views are shown, and then we'll highlight room pin the schedule. So once room pin the schedule is highlighted, we'll press duplicate. And then we'll have to give it a name. So we'll just name this room finish. And press OK. Now we want to press OK, and then we'll go and hit Apply as well. Now we'll open another file here, another project file. We will open. Uh, let's see. Second, I want to go straight to that. So we go file. And we'll hit this one right here. So we're opening another file. Uh, should open soon, I think. Okay, now we have a new file open up. And we want to activate the room schedule in this file. So I'll go down to schedules and open room schedule. Okay, now I have this schedule open. So what we'll do now is We'll select this guy here and we'll right click on it and we'll duplicate this one. And we'll rename it. Room finish schedule. I'll just do this. And go. And just delete this off here. Okay. And we'll say okay there. So now we have our room finish schedule. Now we want to go in here and activate back to our ground floor plan. Now we're back in this floor plan. And we want to activate our Manage Ribbon here, our Manage tab to get the Manage Ribbon. And then we want to uh, transfer project standards. And now at this point, I will just check none, check none. And then I'll just go and find View Templates here. And uh, I'll say OK. So that's bringing over from the other drawing, the view template that we had before. And now right here, these are duplicate types. The following types already exist. 
but are different. We want to say here, uh, new only. So we'll click new only. Now, this imports the new view templates from the scheduled templates project to this project. Now I want to open up my room finish schedule. Then we copy and duplicate it. And there we'll have it. So now what we do at this point, we'll go back into our view template and select none. And we'll go ahead to room finish because we brought it across. We'll say OK. So there's our new room finish schedule that we copied from the other file. So this is just a template that you can create right here, a room finish template. So you can create any templates from any discipline and use them over and over again. So hey, folks, thank you for watching this video. Um, if you like it, like, press like. Um, and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Thanks again and bye.